Be ye steadfast. Drink no longer water, but use a little wine for thy stomach's sake and thine often infirmities. Now listen, does he say use a little strong drink because you're sick? No, because strong drink would make you sick, right? It says it's like you've been smitten. You have to understand in the Bible when it says wine, that means juice. Every time when it says wine, that means juice. So when you look at it, okay, well, that says juice. Is this talking about alcoholic juice or non-alcoholic juice, right? you got to figure that out. Once you get to that point, then you don't have a problem with a lot of the passages. So when, when he's talking about for thy stomach's sake and thine often infirmities, which is sickness, he's saying, hey, you guys are just drinking water and probably because they want to be above reproach, right? He's saying it's okay to drink some fruit juice. You guys need some nutrition, right? Fruit juice helps with nutrition. I mean, hey, go home and make a smoothie, right? Stir up some of them berries and get the fruit in there and get all that good stuff. Get you some nutrition that will help your sickness. So wine, I mean, pure fruit juice. I don't know if you guys have ever had like fresh berries picked off the vine and pressed right then and there. It's like there's life, there's energy in the plant that you can get more so than when you just, you know, get a plastic bottle from the shelf at Walmart, okay? It's, it's totally different. And we may not be able to connect those dots because I drink fruit juice and it's like, okay, so what? It's just sugar, you know? It's a little bit different back then when they're actually picking it and drinking it and it was for nutrition and for health. So he's not teaching to, that it's okay to get drunk here because again, this is written to a man that has this standard of not drinking wine, not getting drunk of being sober. So he's, so he's giving it for, I believe, like the nutritional aspect, the minerals of the fruit juice. In number six, he lines out all the different uses of wine. He talks about wine, strong drink, vinegar of wine, vinegar of strong drink, liquor of grapes. The Bible uses a lot of different words about the products that come from a grape, but there are many words that say juice, that it could be a pomegranate juice. Brother Dustin had a great point the other night. He was like, you know, what about lemon juice? People use lemon juice for medicine. That's a good thought. I never thought of that, right? You can use lemon juice to purify things. They would call that wine. If you squeeze what we call lemonade, they would call that wine. So when it says wine, think fruit juice. And then the question, what type of fruit? And is it a strong drink or a vinegar or a liquor? There's different types of wine. 